Coach, before we jump into the Coastal Carolina game, let's talk a little bit about the Augusta matchup. First game of the season, Augusta had played twice. It was UNCP's first game of the year. Uh, what did you see from your team? Uh, we really struggled out of the gate, I thought, uh, on both ends of the floor, but particularly on the defensive end. You know, uh, we gave up 40, uh, what, 46 points in the first half, which is kind of unheard of. For us, a lot of times we don't give up 46 in a game. And so uh, I just felt like there was, you know, and it was everywhere. It was uh, breakdowns in transition uh, defense. It was allowing shooters open shots. They got it in the post too easy. Uh, offensive rebound. And so I think there was a lot of areas that we need to work on, obviously, defensively. Uh, on the offensive end, I thought our execution was okay. We just got to finish plays and make shots. And I think thought that was the big deal. And then uh, second half was a little better, still a little bit ugly. Uh, try to play everybody, uh, get everybody some experience. Kind of, you know, w we didn't play it as we probably would a real game because it was our first time out there on the court. And we wanted to see a lot of combinations and, g and give a lot of people looks. So I uh, thought Augusta played great def off offensively the first half, though, made some shots. I know during this offseason you didn't really feel like you kind of knew this team yet because you hadn't seen them enough. Do you feel like you have a better idea of what you have yet? Well, just uh, still trying to get all the parts together. You know, we'll have Gabby out there uh, the next two days, which will be nice. Uh, and it's still getting Malia out there, who has not been out there in a game type situation. Uh, and then second semester, uh, hopefully JL will be here and, and give us another handling guard and decision-making guard. So, uh, no, it, it'll be a while before we really get a good feel of what we have. What have been some of the key things you've worked on uh, since the Augusta game leading up to these two games? Well, you asked me on the bus what do I need to work on, and we said a little bit of everything. And I think that's true. I mean, uh, I think uh, on the offensive end, I thought we did some good things. Uh, Try to get the ball to the floor a little faster. I thought we did at times, uh, but it, we did it too much with the dribble, not enough with pitch ahead passes and then attacking. But uh, uh, the one thing we did on offense is attack the rim. Although I didn't think we did a great job of executing our offense, we didn't get it in the post enough. Uh, and so that's one thing we worked on. And defensively, everything. You know, we just worked on a little bit of everything. Looking forward to these two games. You play Coastal Carolina uh, Thursday, Friday, D1 program. What do you feel the benefits are of taking on a D1 school? Well, just uh, really athletic kids. And, you, you know, I said the biggest difference, uh, D1 and D2, is, is, is size. And, uh, you know, you look at their roster and uh, uh, they bring the, I think, the camp, uh, they bring the, the, the sister off the bench who's 6'5". And that's, you know, number one for us, that's a really tough matchup, okay? And then their four is Blount, who's really strong, 5'11", really strong, really skilled, can do a lot of things. Uh, and then they've got two guards, uh, Brown and uh, number four, uh, who can really shoot the three. So, you know, it's kind of a pick your poison against them. Uh, I think, okay, we're going to slow them down inside, then we're going to give up some on the perimeter. If we you know, spread our defense out, we're going to give up something inside. So uh, just playing hard defensively, but I think uh, just, uh, you know, the size, the athletic ability, the length uh, is, is a great test. And how do you kind of attack that size, and uh, both offensively and defensively? Uh, well, the one thing, depending on what lineup we play, make their bigs guard away from the basket a little more. Now, uh, looking at the uh, what South Carolina State tape in the first half of NC State, uh, South Carolina State they zoned a lot, uh, so that they'll play a lot of three-two zone. So, which will be good. We can work our zone attack a little bit. But I think, you know, you got to figure out where you've got some advantages matchup wise, and hopefully, if they're playing size, then you playing somebody that can shoot it or drive it and take advantage of that matchup. But, uh, you know, I just think executing the offense. And it, it, as long as we're getting it inside and, and getting good shots, uh, even if it's just blocked by a 6-5, that's okay uh, right now. We're just trying to execute the offense and get the ball in the spots we want to and, and, and try to get good shots. Do you feel that it's beneficial to have these back-to-back -back games against the same team? You know, Thursday can go in there and, and you realize something, and Friday you have the opportunity to work. Yeah, you know, uh, ideally it would be a, a Thursday, Saturday, where you've got a, a day to practice and work on some things. But, uh, uh, no, I do think it will be very beneficial uh, for us. And, and, you know, they're two exhibitions for us, so they're not, you know, not counting on the record. Uh, so I think it's a great opportunity for – we just need to play outside competition. I mean, we work in practice and kind of see what works in practice, but what's, what's going to work against people that, uh, you know, 
may play defense a little different and may get out in the passing lanes a little bit, may pressure a little bit more, may front the post a little bit, and uh, and just executing our stuff against somebody else. So, you know, that's 80 minutes that we've got to, to try to work on our stuff and get better as we, we move into uh, number one Aiken next week and then move into the second semester of conference play. Lastly, what are you hoping to see from your team over these two games? Really play hard and compete and, and, and just do some of our – Staples a little bit better, our fundamentals. Uh, do a little bit better to, to keep him, keeping the ball in front of us defensively, working a little harder to keep it out of the post, uh, and executing our offense better. Awesome, Coach. Thanks for your time. Best of luck. Appreciate it.